My name is Stacey Beal and I am the High Conflict Relationship Coach at O'Connor Family Law. We're going to talk about some things that you should not say to your kids about a divorce. So if there is anything most people can universally agree on, it is that a divorce can be messy. Particularly when children are involved, it's even messier, right? So during a divorce, the heightened emotions, the disputed finances, and other disagreements only add to the difficult process. The only consistency that you have is the chaos, the love that you have for your children, right? With that in mind, it's really important to take care of a child's physical and emotional needs during this. So here are some things we do not want to tell our children during a divorce. Don't tell a lie. Children are the most powerful lie detectors. Understanding so much more than adults often give them credit for understanding. Transparency about this divorce, including changes in finances, new time constraints, gives children the valuable tool to deal with the real life situation and show them that you are valuing them. Don't speak the unguarded truth. While you don't have to lie to them about divorce, how that truth is told really does matter. So while you're being truthful with your children, avoid shelling out those hurtful statements toward the other parent. Leave those details out of it. Your ex is still their parent. You have to keep that in mind too. It gives your children another reason to respect you if you are not bad-mouthing the other parent. Don't argue in front of your children. By nature, divorce is difficult and any child affected by this process is going to need to make adjustments. They're going to need some time to get used to their new normal and many times this is easier said than done. However, refusing to engage in a verbal battle is a loving way to honor and protect your children from the ravages of the divorce. It's not not a bad way either to reinforce how much you love them. Don't be pushy. Sure, many things are going to change after divorce. A new household, routines, maybe partners coming in and out of a parent's life sooner rather than later. And part of growing up is really learning how to adjust to changes in your life circumstance, right? We all have to adjust in life. So while you might be a pro as an adult, your children are still learning this lesson. So be mindful and give them that time to get used to this. Get used to these changes. Set the tone gently and truly you need to be patient. Your children will thank you later verbally or by example, or perhaps both. Whichever way the gratitude is arrives, you're really going to be proud of them and yourself for the way that you conducted this. 